As New Yorkers, we often have strong opinions about who we can trust with big and small things, who we trust to keep a secret, to cut our hair, to walk our dogs, and watch our kids. But we often overlook one really important thing, who we would trust to make healthcare decisions if we got sick or injured and couldn't speak for ourselves. Did you know that in New York you have the right to appoint someone you trust to make healthcare decisions for you? It's actually pretty easy. All you have to do is fill out a free and quick form called the New York State Healthcare Proxy Form. If you are 18 or older, why not take the time to fill it out today? You can download the free form by doing a quick online search, by clicking the link in the comments, or by visiting our website, endoflifechoicesnewyork.org. Once you download the form, completing it is easy. There are three simple steps. Step one, choose your healthcare agent. First, name someone you would trust to make medical decisions for you and follow your instructions. This can be a friend, family member, neighbor, clergy, anyone. You get to pick the person who would be your best advocate. The person you write on the form is called your healthcare agent. Step two, have a conversation. Now that you've picked who you want to be your healthcare agent, it is important to let them know what kind of treatments you would want so they don't have to guess. You can be as general or as specific as you want. For example, you can just say, I want to do everything possible to prolong my life. Or, I only want things that will keep me comfortable. Write whatever reflects your values. Or instead, you can list specific things you would or would not want under varying circumstances. For example, whether you would want machines to help you breathe and keep your heart beating, tubes to give you food and liquids, antibiotics to treat infections or to be fed with someone else's assistance. More information about each of these things is available on our website. There are no right or wrong answers. These are personal decisions, and it is important to reflect on what you would want. Your wishes can be written on the form or on a separate document you attach to the form. Step three, make it official. Now that you have chosen a healthcare agent and documented your wishes, there's only one last step. All you need to do is sign it and ask two other people to sign as witnesses. They can be friends, family members, or someone else, but it can't be the same person listed as your agent, and they must be 18 years of age or older. Once everyone has signed, make sure you give a copy of the form to your healthcare agent and medical providers, such as your primary care doctor. That's it, you're all done. You have just taken a very important step to plan your future.